don't, don't, I don't do politics. I don't do, well, I do, well, okay, like, I don't know about you guys. My favorite, okay. My favorite show from last year was um, the U.S. midterm elections. Did you guys watch that show? It's a fun show. What a great show that is. You know why? Because everyone, Barack is so funny. Barack is my favorite comedian now. He's so funny. The guy, he's headlining all these rallies. Bernie's sweating up and down the Senate, stumping. Bernie, he's back! Remember Bernie? What am I doing? I'm screaming. I got drunk. I got drunk. Uh, Bernie's back, and do you remember when Trump was elected? Bernie, he, had, he actually had, he had a speech in front of the Senate. It was like, we are not going anywhere. And he like warned everybody, don't worry, we're still here for you. We, I will filibuster in the Senate every day until we can assure bifocals for every American. Remember that? Remember he said that? If elected president, I'm gonna get a bowl of tomato soup and I'm gonna go to bed. I'm an old man. I love Bernie. He's so funny too. All, my, all the Dems are so funny. I love them. But Barack is the funniest. He's the headliner, though. He's the headliner. Goddammit. I watched the midterm elections. Like all the days leading up to it, there's all these speeches that all these like top Democrats have to give, and I love it. It's amazing. But uh, none, none was better when Barack would just hit all the stages. He'd go to all the states and be like, I'm endorsing this governor, I'm endorsing this senator, I'm endorsing this congressperson. And he was the headliner. So the person getting the endorsement wasn't even the head. It's incredible. The person getting the endorsement got to come out and be like, oh. <laughs> at the podium, they're just salivating. Ah, well, now, uh, for, uh, for, without further ado, <laughs> the person he came to see, uh, Barack Hussein, and oh my God, Barack, he came out of the shadows. And he wasn't wearing a tie, and he was like, and the crowd's going, crazy He's not wearing a tie, he's a little untucked, he's so cool, he's, Brock is so cool. Hits the stage, and people are going nuts for like, I want to say, it's like 10, you watch these uncut, these unedited videos of him doing speeches, it's like 10 minutes of him honestly just standing there, looking around, people going nuts. And to the point where he's like, no, 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 could you like to calm them down? No, 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 whoa, 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 hey. No, 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 whoa, whoa, hey, no, 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 whoa, 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 hey, whoa, me and my wife, Michelle, whoa, 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 hey, no, 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 whoa, 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 ten minutes, whoa, 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 don't boo, whoa, hey, whoa, no, 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 and I'm just going nuts because he's a hero to them, and he'll calm them down after like 15 minutes, and then he hits them with a joke, this son of a bitch, he's like, hey, man, what gets him down, a twinkle in his eye, he's like, so, how's the new guy doing? <laughs> and, he goes, and, he, and he does the, you know how like Steve Harvey, I don't know if you guys watch the Family Feud right now, but Steve Harvey, whenever he gets a joke answer from a family member, he's like, oh hey, uh, name something that's made of gold, and the family will go, uh, the Golden Gate Bridge, and he's like, ah! <laughs> Barack does that in his own jokes. He kills himself. That's <laughs> so funny. He's amazing. He's my hero. He's amazing. Oh my. Okay, I've blown my time here. Um, I'll, I, I'm just gonna end with uh, this sentiment. Uh, you guys drinking tonight? Who's drinking tonight? We drinking? Yeah. yeah uh, I like drinking. Like I drink almost anything, but I draw the line at Jello shots. How about it? No one agrees. <laughs> what are we doing chewing our liquor here? Come on, come out the middleman. It's a look. Liquor is already fun. It's a poison that rearranges your personality. What are we doing? <laughs> Making it fun, you know? What are we doing? <laughs> Fucking it up. Imagine, and you know what? You can't just make yourself one Jello shot. You know, imagine if Don Draper fixed himself in the middle of the day in a Jello shot instead of a Jim Beam when he was on that bad man. Um, no one like that. I, <laughs> But my main problem with jello shots, and then I'll get out of here, is because like we we have a weird relationship with shots where we all have to do them at the same time, and you can't just again you can't just make one you gotta bake it or whatever because it's jello you gotta bake it so it's like or whatever and you gotta make a lot of it so it's like it takes like ten or more people often and they're all like oh and you gotta wait for everyone to come back from the bathroom to do it and you're like and then when you do it it's a minute or more of everyone you know doing this oh uh, hey let's toast. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy! <laughs> it's a party drink. You're supposed to keep conversation going at a party, right? What is this? Oh, this is a lovely home. What is it? A ranch-style rambler? Hang on, let me get fucked up for one minute here. <laughs> it's not charming. Anyway, I'm Chris Thank you so much.